Um, I think we have a question from Tom Bradbury. Mr President, Tom Bradby, ITV News. Quite a lot of people in the UK feel that your determination as a country to continue to push for the extradition of um, computer hacker and Asperger sufferer Gary McKinnon is disproportionate and somewhat harsh. Do you think it is time now to consider some leniency in this case? And Prime Minister, you've expressed very strong views on this matter, suggesting that Mr McKinnon shouldn't be extradited. Your Deputy Prime Minister has expressed even stronger views. Did you discuss that with the President today? And if not, would now be a good moment to share your views with us once again? Shall I go? Uh, please, go ahead. Um, it is something that we, we discussed in our, our meeting. Um, I mean, clearly there's a discussion going on between um, the British and the Americans about this, um, and I don't want to prejudice those discussions. We completely understand that um, uh, Gary McKinnon stands accused of uh, a very important and significant crime in terms of uh, hacking into vital databases, and nobody denies that that is uh, an important crime that has to be considered. But I have had conversations with the U.S. Ambassador, as well as raising it today with, uh, with the President, about this issue, and, and I hope a way through can be, can be found. Well, uh, uh, one of the things that David and I discussed was the increasing challenge that we're going to face uh, as a consequence of the Internet and the need for us to cooperate extensively on issues of cybersecurity. Uh, you know, we, we had a brief discussion about uh, the fact that uh, although there may still be efforts to send in spies and try to obtain state secrets through traditional Cold War methods, the truth of the matter is these days where we're going to see enormous amounts of vulnerability when it comes to information is going to be uh, through uh, these kind of uh, breaches in, in our uh, uh, information systems. Uh, so we take this very seriously, uh, and I know that uh, the British government does as well. Uh, beyond that, uh, you know, uh, one of the traditions we have is uh, uh, the president doesn't get involved in uh, decisions around prosecutions, uh, extradition matters. Uh, so what I expect is that my team will follow the law, uh, but they will also coordinate closely with what uh, we've just stated is uh, an ally that is unparalleled in terms of uh, uh, our cooperative relationship. And I trust that this will get resolved in a way that uh, underscores the seriousness of the issue, but also uh, underscores the fact that uh, we work together and uh, we can find a, an appropriate solution. All right. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you very much.